I was living in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. I was a total heavy metal rocker chick. I was angry at God in the world, and my family was falling apart. And I was invited to church and studied the Bible in the campus ministry in Milwaukee. And over the course of the next year, every member of my family also became a disciple. So I was living in Moscow, Russia. I was a recording artist at the peak of my career. And people invited me to church over and over again. I didn't go until I was rock bottom. And then I went. I studied the Bible. It changed my life in about two and a half weeks. I became a Christian. And within six months, several members of my family became Christians as well. I'm an international person. I grew up on three different continents by age seven. Russia, Chile, Germany, Africa. Learned four languages by age nine. I grew up in a small town in Wisconsin, but I did my junior year abroad and lived in Sao Paulo, Brazil, and that's where I learned Portuguese, and I think where God put on my heart the desire to live and serve in other countries. And I speak Portuguese as well. That was our first connection, actually. So we met at this uh, conference for Christians in show business, and I was a performer and a speaker, and Deb was one of the organizers. And I needed to get his bio information for a concert that evening, so I was asking all kinds of questions about him. It was very intriguing. And at the end of it, he was like, so what about you? Who are you? And we went on a date to Universal Studios. We dated long distance. She moved from Los Angeles to Moscow. And our wedding was in front of 1,800 of our closest friends. <laughs> We've been very happily married for 23 years. And we have three beautiful adult daughters, Diana, Violetta, and Isabella. So we moved to Austin about 10 years ago to plant a community, a church that we call Tribe, and we really, really love this family of believers. We wanted to try something different and take some innovative and creative new approaches to doing ministry. We love serving our tribe, and in addition to the ministry, I've homeschooled our daughters for the last 13 years. I'm pursuing biblical counseling. We've continued to serve in international missions. We started a nonprofit organization, the Ascend Academy, in Maputo, Mozambique, and most recently, the Ukraine Relief Network. And I love startups and marketing, so we have a company called Third Drive, which we do venture development with and marketing for companies. I've also developed a coaching program called Exponential Life, which teaches happiness as a skill. Uh, to people who want to combine spiritual disciplines, research, and certain habits to create a high-impact life. I love our tribe. I love Austin Christian Church. It's an amazing community. It's been very healing and encouraging. It's both inspiring and life-giving. I feel these are our glory days because we wanted to plant a church that serves the city, that is multi-generational, a place our kids would want to be a part of. And God has given us that. He has. <laughs>